Now, if you don't know about Minecraft, your child probably does. Released in 2009, Minecraft is now the second best-selling game of all time, outranked only by Tetris. On top of being one of the most popular games ever, it's also considered to be one of the most educational. Games like Minecraft have been shown to improve cognitive skills such as hand-eye coordination, resource management, and creative problem solving. But those aren't even the super cool ones. So here's the top seven things that you didn't know your child can learn from Minecraft. Java is one of the most widely known programming languages, and it's also the language used to make Minecraft. This means that by writing your own Java code, you can mod Minecraft. Or in other words, you can add your own stuff into the game. Companies like Codakid have been using this to get kids excited about coding and teach real programming skills while making a mod. In these courses, kids can do things like make their own creature or generate an entire new world, and it's all done through the magic of writing code. Making mods is a lot of fun, but there are also a ton of educational mods to be found on the internet. Galacticraft is a gigantic mod that adds space travel to the game, using planets from our solar system. Every planet has a different environment, and players will find themselves building bases while managing oxygen levels, generating power, and battling extreme temperatures. It's not rocket science, but this level of detail might just make it the next best thing. If you're an American like I am, then you may have never heard of Tate, an institution which runs four major art museums in the UK. Well, in addition to their real-life museums, Tate has released a number of Minecraft worlds which will have you jumping into classic paintings Super Mario 64 style to learn about the real history behind the art. Players will solve puzzles in last centuries New York and London, all while learning about the historical context of what's going on. Even using Photoshop to make a 2D picture can seem daunting, but creating a full-on piece of 3D digital artwork can seem downright impossible, which makes it all the more impressive that kids are using Minecraft to make 3D models. And I'm not just talking about building houses. A mod called Tabula is a 3D modeling tool for Minecraft. Models made with Tabula can be included in Minecraft mods. Children use Tabula to create creatures for their mods, all while learning the technical skill to manipulate objects in a 3D space. According to Richard Feynman, anyone who says that they understand quantum mechanics doesn't. But that doesn't stop us from trying. QCraft is a Minecraft mod that brings the principles of quantum physics into the world of blocks. Players will learn about the basic principles of quantum mechanics by playing with quantum blocks, such as this block that changes its state when observed. Now, if you want your Minecraft science to be a little bigger but still microscopic, Molecraft has got you covered. This world was created by chemistry students at the University of Hull and features a library of molecular dioramas that will put your chemistry textbook to shame. Players can solve puzzles and go on scavenger hunts, all while reading about the real molecules they're exploring. Redstone is a sparkly red dust that has been in Minecraft since the very beginning. When redstone is powered, it lights up and it provides power to any other redstone it's touching. If this is starting to sound a lot like wires and electricity to you, then you're not alone. Players have figured out how to use redstone to create logic gates, which are the building blocks of computation. Redstone circuitry can be used to create contraptions ranging from automatic farms to working calculators. That's right, with Minecraft, you can make a full-blown computer inside your computer. Hey there, thanks for watching this video. Did I miss any cool maps or mods? Let me know in the comments. And as always, make sure you slap that like button if you liked it, and slap that subscribe button for more cool stuff.